hello everyone welcome back in this video we are going to make a 3d logo animation using adobe after effects so before starting this tutorial let's have a look what we will create today This was the animation we are going to make in this video so first of all if you are new to my channel then please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to get all of my new videos notification so now let's jump into the video first open your after effects then go to composition and create a new composition i am going with 1920 pixel by 1080 pixel and 30 frame rate per second you can rename it to main and I am going to hit 16 second and background color is black now hit ok so now let's import our files to here I am using this video photos here and using my logo so select them and drag this to here all of the photos you can download from the link in video description now create a folder and rename it to files select all of this video photos and drag them to this folder now create another folder called logo now insert your logo to the composition or the after effects so i'm using use this logo you can use your own logo so select this drag to this logo folder now let's select the logo and drag this to the timeline and then again select the logo right click on your mouse then pre composite and rename it to logo comp select move all attribute to the new comp layer now hit ok double click it and click on this option then select this now go to composition and select cop to the region of interest okay now this is our logo area now back to the main composition select this logo then go to layer and select auto dress now from here select alpha then uncheck this apply to new layer option then hit ok it will create a mask here now hide this layer right click on your mouse then go to new and create a new solid layer rename it to element 3d now hit ok now go to the effects and select video copyleft then select element now go to the customize layer then select custom text and mask and from the path one select the logo comp close this and click the send setup now from here click this option and turn off the grid and then click the extrude option so this is our 3d logo and by selecting this go to the here and select it to extreme now select this bevel 1 and change the extrude to 1.5 now go to the pebble outline and check this enable ok now again click on this extra option again make it to ultra then select this level and again go to this extra option and make this 1.5 also Now go to the preset option and from here go to the element 3d material pack 1 select this 100 brass then drag this to the this point now select this and drag this to this level 1 Now just follow my steps. Expand the bevel edge. 
and change the bevel size to something like this. And drag this to this point. Make it point three zero. Now rename it to gold. Now select this and duplicate this model. Select this and drag this to this point and take and duplicate this drag this to the center select this and change its size to 0 0.10 or maybe 0 0.15 and now go to the procedure to go to metal Clean metal this, apply this to this. Now go to the bevel outline and select the inside bevel and increase it something like this and select the black one also increase it now go to create and create a new plate and select this make it to 10 size x y make it also 10 now select this press shift and drag this like this select this now go to the plane mode and apply metal black to this here now select this go to mirror effect reflection mode then select the mirror surface and select this cold one and again go to mirror reflect mode and select spherical now just hit ok now right click on your mouse create a new camera i am going with 30 millimeter camera and i will depth field then hit ok select this camera press ctrl d two time to duplicate it turn off above once now select this go to around 4 second select this press alt and right bracket key to cut it here and select this press alt left bracket key here and go to around 8 second and press alt right bracket key now drag this to this point select the camera one then from here select orbit camera tool drag this something like this just adjust it and follow my steps go to camera option camera aperture make 30 and make it 600 bar level make 80 select the camera go to effect control sorry select the element 3d option then go to render setting and then go to ambient and enable this to close this select the camera and just follow me go to first frame and go to transform and select the point of interest and position go to around again 4 second 
then drag this to this point and make it something like this now close this turn on this camera to select this and adjust it go to camera option again Thirty-six hundred. Transform, select point of interest and position. Go to again eight second forward and select this. Move it to this point. and drag this to something like this now turn off this turn on the camera 3 go to camera option and aperture 30 focus distance 600 and make it 70 close and select the drag z camera tool make it bigger go to around 30 second take keyframes here back to the 8 second rotate this like this Zoom it Okay, close this select this press alt and right back key Now select this logo com press ctrl D to duplicate it go to something like here turn on this and rename it to logo reveal Press M to open mask, delete all of this mask from here and adjust its position. Okay. Now select the element 3D back to the 12 second. Press D to open opacity, make it 100%. Go to this point and make it zero go to here select the robin again press t make it zero and go to the next frame and make it 100 percent select this you can move it to this point and from here you can select the rogue level and press p to open position create a keyframe go to something like this and drag this logo to this point you can press right click on your mouse go to text create a new text and you can type your title here Press P to open position, create a keyframe, back to here, you can drag this to this point, select this, press alt, left bracket key, now go to layer, new, create a new shape layer, create a shape with this drag this to below the title then from here select the alphabet place this below the 
logo select the shape layer and make it size now turn on all of this camera go to project window and select the files turn drag the layer one to the composition timeline then drag this to this point and flare to drag this to here <coughs> and drag the lens flare to the composition drag this to this point go to the text reveal option okay now at last drag this to timeline and go to the mode select it to add okay now let's see the preview So our animation is ready and this is how you can make a 3D logo animation using Adobe After Effects. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed then make sure that you like this video and subscribe this channel and don't forget to share this video with your friends. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.